In addition to the cotton bags, we're also using organic cotton uh, shoelaces that are waxed. We're using recycled paper for our shoe boxes. Uh, we're also doing uh, natural rubber for our shoe soles. Yeah, how does it work? I mean, it's like a really unique relationship because me and Jawad, uh, like the vision of the brand and the ideas and the concepts was formulated over so many years together, you know? Uh, of course, like, this whole operation is pointless without Jawad because he gives us a lot of cred credibility. Um, I get a lot of my um, inspiration from you guys as well, you know what I mean? Like, from my good do, looks. I might do the design, mm -hmm. but AZ ha always has an opinion <coughs> and input, and it's like everybody's input and opinion. That's what makes NZ NZ. There's certain things we had to compromise on that we weren't, we were hoping, obstacles we were hoping we could overcome. We know in the future we will be able to overcome them. We can't do it just yet. But we're committed, I mean, we're just as passionate about anybody as make, I mean, the goal when we designed our first shoe, Menelik, the first shoes that we're doing, we wanted to make it 100% biodegradable shoe. Like, if you just left it on the sidewalk for hundreds of years, it would just naturally decompose. And that's still our goal with this shoe. We can't quite get there yet, but we will. So, I mean, compromising on some of those pieces. We like to, and, uh, you know, which is m mostly the leather. Um, we haven't been able to, to get that eco-friendly leather put together just yet, but we didn't want to sacrifice the look or the feel of the shoe quite yet, because that's our, again, our primary goal, is to really change people's perceptions of Africa. And we believe that down the road, we can change people's perceptions, as well as being eco-friendly, as well as, I mean, we've taken every, so it's a compromise we had to make at the meantime, you know, we, uh, and it took us, it was a hard decision to make. I mean, we committed roughly a year to trying to source eco-friendly leather. Uh, and it just, it, it just was, the local leather, leather production is just not quite there yet. But we have partners that are willing to work with us to develop this. So once we get, especially once we get to a big enough level where we can do the research and development to produce eco-friendly leather, the tanners are happy to partner with us on that. All the, all the components of the shoe are, are natural. Because we're trying to produce a high quality product, but we don't want to damage the Ethiopian environment in the process. All right, so this is the leather some of the leather that makes, makes up our shoe. And we've got, this is the highest grade available. You know, we really want to show off what's possible um, in Ethiopia with the leather. So it's an unfinished leather and all the colors are natural because I want, the, I want to show off the, the natural characteristics of the leather. So this is the brown, this is the gray. Again, you can really see the, the grain in the leather natural characteristics and the, the blemishes as well, which add to the unique characteristics of each skin. We really tried to find um, environmental leather. It's been a challenge because a lot of the tanneries produce big orders to, 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 to send to, to Europe or the States. Nobody's asking this of the tanneries here. So they just produce it how they're used to producing it, which unfortunately is with um, chemicals and all that kind of stuff. So until somebody comes and demands and says, look, we need to make leather that doesn't dump chromium into the local um, river system, they have no incentive to do that. So that's, why, that's, that's where we feel we need to at least make an effort and, and encourage that side of their business. You know, we want to ask for chrome-free leather. We want to come and, and, and experiment and try and make this from natural um, tannins, you know. So this is part of the NZ goal.